house concert several years back. So I'm like playing all these songs about animals and wildlife and wild places. And this guy asks me, have you ever thought about writing something about insects? And I'm like, no, but I like the way you think. <laughs> Turns out this guy was a retired entomologist from Virginia Tech. <coughs> but he kind of put that in my mind, because uh, I'm definitely a fan. Um, and so um, during the pandemic, um, I wrote it. And so the way that I did it was um, I called the six and eight legs, and it's insects and spiders. And so it's represented in the music. You have two bars of three for the six legs, and then a bar of four. Um, eighth notes represent the eight legs of the spider. And so um, for the most part, the piece, the entire piece, alternates that rhythm throughout, ex except in a few breaks, until eventually, eventually at the end, the spider stays. <laughs> I thought this would turn out to be kind of a strophic, you know, song. Uh, but you know when you write music, a lot of times it wants to be what it wants to be. So this wanted to be a theme and variations. And so um, I'm going to play this for you. And it's actually, it has become a long piece, so I'm not going to play the whole thing. Um, and it's too difficult anyway, so some of it. I, I seriously can't, still can't play very well. Some of the variations. So I'll just kind of give you the broad strokes. Now everybody can hear this okay? Yeah. Okay.
most of it anyway. So what I should have told you was that um, I like to um, like to tell people to lose all of their various preconceived notions that most of us have about insects and creepy crawly things and spiders and try to view them as, as beautiful and endearing and vital creatures. When you look at baby insects or spiders, you don't think the same thing when you look at baby ducks <laughs> or kittens, right? But what if you did? Why wouldn't you, right? So um, I like to challenge people to think that way, but I'm telling you in hindsight, but <laughs> some of that music is supposed to evoke that. Um, do you also know that a few doors down at the greenhouse, there's a tarantula that lives in there? Isn't that awesome? Peach is the tarantula. You can go visit her anytime. So that's, that's what it is. 